You never know when your breath is stinky. You don't want to talk to people and they just like get a whiff of that nasty breath. Hello everyone, I'm Marilyn and today I'm going to be showing you what's in my backpack for the 2021 to 2022 school year. So this upcoming school year, I'm going to be a senior in high school. It'll be my last year of high school, finally. I'm excited. My school's in person now. We're not doing online anymore. I am going to be using this backpack. This is a black Jansport backpack, and it has fake brown leather at the bottom. I've used this backpack since freshman year, so it's lasted quite a long time. Let me just give you an overview of everything on the outside. I have two pins just for decoration. First pocket we're going to be starting off with is the main pocket right here. In this first pocket, I have all of my main school supplies. There's also a laptop compartment. As you can see, I'm using the laptop lid for all of my folders. Let me take it out. These are all of my folders and journals for each of my classes. As you can see, I have a rainbow variety of colors here. I've also had these in freshman year. I don't see a point in buying more if you already have good condition ones, especially because these are the plastic ones. I'm taking six classes this year. AP Computer Science, Symphonic Orchestra, Honors English 12, Honors Calculus, calculus with application and economics network operations which is a double period for the red folder i have ap computer science as you can see i labeled the folder using washi tape and then i'm gonna put clear tape on top of this if you label with sharpie or whatever you can't really reuse it i find putting cute washi tape here as a label is very handy if i want to replace it i can just peel off the washi tape and then put another label here out. I have this spiral college rule journal from Walmart. It was 50 cents, so that was a really good deal. I only like writing in college rule. I hate white rule. It's so nasty. Like, too much space in between. I honestly don't think I'm going to be using this journal or AP computer science because most of the stuff will be on the computer, but this is here just in case. For blue, I have English, and then there's also a blue journal. And I have my network operations class. This is from the brand Yubi. I think every item you buy from Yubi, they donate. This is 32. It's a really good brand. I feel like this this folder is better than the Staples folder. This is from Staples, by the way. For my yellow folder, I have Orchestra. There's like a yellow washi tape here. This is my weakest folder, like floppy-wise, because Orchestra, you don't really need that many papers. You just put your music in it. This teal folder, I have Calculus. Unfortunately, I couldn't find a journal at Walmart that's the same color. These two are very bright. Lastly, my green folder, I have Economics, because it's green for money, you know? And I also have a corresponding green journal. All right, continuing on with my backpack in the main compartment. We're done with this laptop slip right here. Next, I have my pencil pouch. This is a sticker Santa gift from my friend Paige. So thank you so much, Paige. I really freaking love this pencil pouch. It's like a white grid and then there's pink zippers. I have a video what's in my pencil pouch. If you guys want to see the contents in here, there will be a link in the description. This year, I'm not bringing that much, but I have my main writing tools here and then my note stuff in this pocket. The what's in my pencil pouch video was filmed like almost two years ago, but everything is basically the same. Moving on, I have a book. This is um, the Queen of Blood. I'll always have a book in my backpack because I hate like the awkward silences in class when you're not allowed to go on your phone like you're just staring off the space, but your teacher won't yell at you if you're reading a book. And then the last item inside this main compartment is my planner. Now, I haven't really bought a official planner for school yet. Update, I got a planner from Five Below. For some reason, my high school doesn't give planner to juniors and seniors, which doesn't make any sense because those I feel like are the two most stressful years of high school, but they don't give us a planner to organize our stuff. But anyways, this was my planner for online school, Zoom school. It was just like a plain notebook. I devised a little system here. I drew all these stuff. You can see in some of my old school vlogs setting this up. Unfortunately, I can't keep doing this because it takes quite a lot of time to draw. So I'm gonna have to find a planner. My mom did buy me this humongous planner. Since it is so big, I don't think I want to bring it to school. I'll just leave it at home. It's really pretty. It has this nice tropical design on the cover. What I find I really like about it is that there's stickers. Who doesn't love stickers? So I have all these stickers I can use. They have like emoji type of stickers. I think this is for like a mood tracker. So that was everything in this first pocket. We're gonna be moving on to, there's another hidden pocket right here. In this pocket, I have my lunch box. It's not a box, it's a bag. I really like how small and compressible it is because I hate it when the backpack is really fat, like thick, wide. So that's why I have this type of lunch box instead of those gigantic lunch boxes. This one you can fold it and smush it up so it doesn't take up much space. That's all that's in that pocket essentially. 
actually. Now we're moving on to the smaller pockets. I have three small pockets here. In this first one, I have this little keychain. It's kind of nasty because it's really old. My friend Megan gave this to me when I was in middle school. It's not focusing. I just have that attached to this. In this pocket, is the easy to reach stuff. I have my charger. I don't think I'll be using my charger often in school because I've never had my phone go below critical percentage, but this is here just in case I need to use it. If you guys want to differentiate your chargers with everyone else's chargers, I recommend putting washi tape around. My charger has a red washi tape with my name on it. Next, I have my earbuds. I always listen to music when I'm in the hallway. Oil absorbing sheet. You never know when your face is a little oily, so you can just pull this out and dab some, pick up the oil. And then I have my chapsticks. I have this Vaseline one, the small rosy one. And then I have Burt's Bees lip tint. I don't know if the camera's focused right now. We're just gonna assume it is. Lastly, I have my phone. If my teacher is like, put your phones away, I'll quickly throw it into this pocket because it's the most accessible. That's everything in that tiny little pocket. Moving on to the second to last one, we have this little pop-up pocket right here. In here, there's like an organization thingy. There's little pockets for your pencils and little stuff here. In this pocket, I have glasses. I wear contacts, so if my eyes get really dry and I have to take out my contacts, I have my glasses here. Next, I have a portable charger. Again, I don't think I'll be using this because my battery doesn't run out much when I'm at school, but this is here just in case. It's also a hand warmer. Next, I have a spare pencil in case I lose mine or someone wants to borrow it. This is like a, a crusty pencil. This is really old, so if someone does want to borrow it, at least I can give them this one and I don't have to worry about if they lose it. I have a pack of gum. You never know when your breath is thinky. You don't want to do talk to people and they just like get a whiff of that nasty breath. So I have some gum here. This isn't the best gum. There's not that much flavor in it, but it does its job keeping my breath nice and minty. I also have my calculator. This is where I keep all of my pads and tampons. And then lastly, I have none other than a bag of dried mangoes. If you watch my videos, you'll know I always have mangoes everywhere I go. Dried mango pieces. These are the dried mangoes from Costco. About to bring dried mangoes. These are my favorite snacks. This is here in case I'm hungry in the middle of class. I would hate for my stomach to growl really loud in the middle of class, so I always have to have food on me. And then finally, the last pocket is this little pocket right here. There's only two items in here, I think. First, I have extra hair ties and scrunchie. I have this like keychain hook thingy. I don't know what it's called. I put a bunch of hair ties on here. And then lastly, I have pretend my school ID is in here. I just didn't put it in because I don't want to show you guys what school I go to. That's all of the stuff. Oh wait, I have one more. Hand sanitizer. So this is obviously very handy. COVID-19 is still here. So I have some Bath and Body Works hand sanitizer. Honestly, I don't think this is reliable, but I do have more hand sanitizer with more alcohol. And then of course I would have my mask. My school is requiring students to wear masks, obviously. Finally, the last item is this water bottle. So on the side of my backpack, I have this mesh pocket, but I have my water bottle here. I honestly don't think I'll be bringing this gigantic water bottle because once it's full, it's heavy, uh, but it's my thermal flask from Costco. Either I will bring this water bottle or a plastic water bottle. So yeah, that is all the stuff that is in my backpack for my senior year of high school. This is my first time filming this type of video. I don't think I've filmed uh, what's in my backpack before, but hopefully I'll keep filming it when I'm in college. Unfortunately, if you guys want the links to some of the items I have here, I do not have it. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching. If you watched this far, please comment down the backpack emoji. I'll put it right here. Otherwise, I hope to see you guys in my next video. Bye! Bye.